No. Ah. I don't know what's going on, but they say I've been charged with charged with murder. Stop blowing cherries. No promise. I should specify there's two red chairs in each corner, so. I'm gonna ask you if you wanted a coffee or water. You, you're good? You, you okay? Just give me a minute, I'm gonna grab something, and I'll be back in to talk to you real quick, okay? Mm -hmm. Cool, thanks, man. If you need something in the meantime, just not let me know. Mm -hmm. Want a blanket or anything? I'm okay. You all right? Okay. Mm -hmm. So I'm Detective Saunders. Uh, this is Detective Chandler. He's one of the guys that works on the same team as me. If you want, you people. Call me Chandler or Neil. Oh man. Okay. It's cold up there. All right. So I want to talk to you um, about something, um, but obviously, as you know, you're in custody. So um, yeah, I'm not talking to you about your current charges. Okay. I'm not going to do anything about you know what you're in for right now. So, um, but to protect you and to protect me, um, we're just going to go over your rights um, that are provided to you. You know, the Supreme Court decided that you know, I have to warn you about, okay? Um, so, we're just going to do that first. I just spent a lot of time as a detective, and I know you'll spend a lot of time as a detective, and sometimes when you just kind of start out just reading people the rights, they kind of freak out. So, I just kind of try to preface it with, like, it's all okay. We're not rushing into anything. The main reason I'm doing it is just because you're in custody. Okay? All right. So this top line right here, I'm going to put a blue line next to it. Can you just read that out loud for me so I know that you can read? I have following rights under the United States Constitution. That's right. I got the rest of it. So you can take your, if you feel comfortable taking your mask off, I'm fine. I've been vaccinated. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm vaccinated, vaccinated too. too. All right. You do not have to make a statement or say anything. Anything you say can be used against you in court. You have the right to talk to a lawyer for advice before you make a statement or before any questions are asked of you, and to have the lawyer with you during any questioning. If you cannot afford to hire a lawyer, one will be appointed for you before any questioning if you wish. If you do answer questions, you have the right to stop answering questions at any time and consult with a lawyer. You understand that? All right. Can you sign right here where it says signature? It's just acknowledging that I read these to you. Okay. Awesome. Thank you, sir. So let's top it to, we're at the police memorial building. I'm just going to abbreviate it PMB because memorial is a hard word to spell. Um, it is the 5th of November and it's 4.35 in the afternoon. All right. So do you remember me, Therese? I know we, we did talk the night that um, you were taken into custody. I might look a little bit more familiar now that I have glasses on. Do you remember me or no? Yeah? Okay. So um, the first night that we spoke, do you remember what we spoke about? Yes. Okay. Um, basically, just kind of said, hey, you know, tell me about your day. Um, tell me what you did. And um, you told me that you spent the night at a girl's house, right? At a, I think you said a female's house. Mm -hmm. Spent the night at a girl's house. Then you slept in late, and you go and got some breakfast. Um, I don't remember where. You told me where, but you went and got some breakfast. And then your friend told you to slide by the studio, and she went by the studio. Right? Does all that sound familiar? I don't know if I said anything about breakfast, but I don't know. You don't remember breakfast, but does yet does any of that sound like wildly inaccurate? Does all that sound like a like something that you would tell me? Is it what? Is it, I'm, at, that's, I'm just kind of going over, just paraphrasing the interview that we had previously. Mm -hmm. 
you say you don't really remember, and that's okay. But if you don't, it's okay that you don't remember exactly what you said. But does that sound similar to like what you would tell me? Does that kind of sound similar to the day before you get arrested? No? Yeah, probably. Yeah. Okay. All right. I just want to make sure that there wasn't any gross misconceptions. You feel like I'm mischaracterizing you anyway. Um, so you told me that you were at the rec recording studio all day until the police grabbed you. When the police pulled up, you know, you were scared, you went outside, and that's when they took you into custody, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. So we were doing an investigation, um, and, I, and I think I asked you about a homicide that I was investigating that also occurred that day. Yeah, my lawyer told me not to uh, answer no questions if she wasn't here. Your lawyer told you not to answer any questions if they weren't here? Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. So do you not you don't want to talk the rest of the way? Okay. All right. That's okay. Um, who is your lawyer? It's Nicole. Nicole? Nicole Jameson. Nicole Jameson? Do you know how to spell Jameson? Mm -hmm. No. I know, I know who she is. Okay. Okay. All right. Um, well, then I'll probably give Ms. Jameson a call. Isn't Ms. Jameson, isn't she like in Fernina Beach? Or, so, yeah. yeah. Okay. All right. Well, we can do that. Um, I'm gonna do some paperwork. Okay. You are being charged with second degree murder and possession of firearm by a juvenile delinquent. How? Oh. I can't talk to you anymore about the case because you requested a wish to have your lawyer here, which is fine. You're well within so your rights. Could I want to talk? I'm saying being charged with this. N no, there's other circumstances which I'm happy to explain to you, but you told me you don't want to talk without your attorney here. You're welcome to take that back, but you've told me that you don't want to talk without well, your attorney, like so I can't saying, talk any further. I'm saying, but how am I being charged with something that I don't have nothing to do with because I, my attorney said if I'm asking any questions. No, Therese, I'm, uh, I was going to bring you over and ask you about that incident. But I still want to get charged with it. Yeah, you're going to get charged with murder, yes. You have a warrant for second degree murder and for possession of a firearm by a juvenile delinquent. Okay, or by, by an adjudicated delinquent, pardon me, because you're an adult now. So when when you request to have a lawyer with you, and that's totally fine, I'm not going to ask you any more questions, and I'm not going to discuss the case, unless you say, no, I want to, and we can go over your rights again, but I will just tell you what you're charged with and how to get in contact with me. I'm going to do some paperwork. You can knock on the door, call out, do whatever, and then if you need me, we can go to the bathroom, get you some water, or do whatever, okay? But if you don't want to talk about your lawyer, that's okay. I'm telling you what you're charged with, and I'm going to go do some paperwork. Okay? All right. If you need me or you need to go to the bathroom or anything, there's a sign on the door. Not call out. Let me know. All right? Sorry, I should have been more specific because you have a little bit more information. Now you're probably in the dark thing. What the hell's going on? It's the you're being charged for the murder of um, took place on September 28th of this year. Okay. Well, how long would it be before I get back to? The... I don't know. It, it, I I got to do some paperwork. I got to get stuff verified and everything. It'll take a little bit of time. Okay. All right. Sit tight for me. I appreciate it.
See what my charges is. Um, if you still, that ain't probably dead yet. Oh yeah, I forgot. Who phone you using? Yeah, the detectives. I asked him could I call you because it was too 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 long to take me back to the building. He I guess he was being nice and let me use it. For real, ma. I promise, like, this shit looks so crazy, like. Man, what the fuck they got going on, man? Oh, man. You were just sleep? No, I was just standing on my phone, looking at my phone, playing my game. Call my daddy. Hold on. I don't know what kind of evidence they got, but I think they were going to tell me, but I was like, I didn't want to talk. And my lawyer went here, so then they said, okay, we're going we're gonna to let you know you've been charged with uh, second degree murder and possession of a firearm. I didn't hear nothing you were saying. I was calling your daddy. Tell, they charged you with murder. For real? Yeah. When they hit. Oh, fuck. So what the. Oh, shit. I don't know what the fuck they got then. I don't know. They just said they told me uh, second degree murder but in the possession of a firearm by shooting out the Lincoln. Then when I came in here, they was like, uh, they was like, remember what we talked about last time? And then I was like, yeah, they was like, uh, so about that day, you was telling us such, 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 such. Like, they were trying to repeat what I told them that day while I was at and stuff. 
And I was like, my, my lawyer was like, uh, don't say nothing, don't answer any questions if she's not here, no matter what it's about. And then they was like, okay. And then they were like, well, all right, sis, you're not going to answer any questions. We, we have to, we have, we have, we're, we're going to tell you what you're form, being formally charged with. And then they told me that. Oh, are they trying to get you to testify about that other stuff? Okay. This is, they just talking with this. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, nothing. So you're going to have to go to court tomorrow? Oh, most likely. Man, these crackers, trying. They, they just doing it because they know you're going to get out. That's it. Yeah, yeah. That's why they're doing that they shit. They're going to get out. Project. Yeah. So you think if I prove my phone, then that car they gotta drop it? Yeah, cause yeah, like what what evidence they got to hit you with that? Um, I don't know. They saying they said possession of a firearm too. Like like they found a gun or something. Man, what man? Don't say you ain't got shit to say to them. You got a fucking lawyer. Like tell them to send you back across that street. Yeah, you ain't got shit. To, you ain't got shit to talk about. You nothing to talk about. I know. That's what you, that's what that's what you lawyer do to talk for you. Let them motherfucker do their job. Cause them motherfuckers lying. But that phone wasn't no motherfucking car. I don't know if that's the evidence they're trying to use or not. I don't know. Well, that's part of that. Well, let, let me show what the fuck they got there. Your lawyer can get everything that they got. Yeah. Everything. You ain't got shit to say. Nothing. It's crazy, dog. So crazy. You don't get out of this shit. Even, even with that, we have to give your bond on murder. I know, but they might not get my other bond back being that I'm very charged with murder. They got a set bond for both of them. I'm talking about for my, for my first possession charge. I think they charged me with another gun, too. I don't know. But they said possessing no fire on by doing not delinquent. They said it later. That's the same charge you already had. Yeah, it gotta be. That's the same charge you already had. Yeah, they ain't catching with no gun. They ain't taking it on a police report. Yeah, they, 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 that's the, that's so the that's charge you already charged with. Well, just, then they were just saying that. Yeah, that's the charge you already charged with. So what, first parents in the morning? Yeah. Yeah, that's the charge you already charged with. Yeah, that's the charge you already charged it's probably about now. I don't know. It ain't gonna get um sharp, but he ain't gonna he can't he got to go back to the bank and get books and stuff like that. Let me text your lawyer. Let me tell um this one call your lawyer. I was on the phone with Mr. when they called me too. I told him I was gonna call him back. They were calling me out. I thought I was gonna go to the state attorney's office. Yeah. But they said I could be on this phone as long as till they come get me, as long as I keep it on speaker. Probably so they can hear what we're talking about. It don't matter. We know you ain't do this shit. They might well let you the fuck go with some bullshit, man. Mm. Man, this is some bullshit. Like you said, I'm going to be strong for you, baby. Because I know when you ain't did shit, I know you're going to get out of this shit. I'm not even going to cry. Mm. 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 They came again at. They ain't even charged with it yet. I know. Ain't he's in the system. Yeah, ain't in the system yet. Uh -huh. You're doing the paperwork probably still. I'm just trying to scare you one to talk. I don't think they can. I don't think they know how to do that though. They allowed to do what? They want to do that. Because last time they told me, last time I remember for my pistol charge, when I told them I didn't want to talk, they said they told me what I was charged with, and then I was charged with it for real. We'll see how this goes. Every time different shit. Every time at a different time. You ain't got shit to say. You got a lawyer. How long you been there, baby? Since like, mm, like four o'clock, probably. One? Four. What time it is right now? I'm glad he let me call you, though. I'm glad they let you call me, too, baby. I'm like, who the heck is this? But you know, I always have 
said he wants to do it. Yeah. I don't know where in the world, man. And did they did they did they say what murder or who murdered yeah. or what? Yeah, I just told you. Okay. They said the one that was related to that. Yeah. Okay. And they only charged you with second degree murder. Mm hmm. Sound like bullshit. That's what I was saying. If anything, why would it be for shit? Yeah, and, and it should be other charges because shit, I, I don't heard people talking about that shit. Like, right? just people from people talking. And yeah. What I'm saying don't make sense. Yeah, you know, it, it should be more than that. Should, it should be more than that charge. If they're saying you, you did it. So they probably finna put me on a different floor and all, I ain't finna be on the sex floor no more. Oh, mm, bro, I'm not trying to sit in here all this time, dog. Well, I like you think about LaRoe, I've been in there for four years, boy. Yeah, um, <clears throat> we do have the phone number for your attorney, so if you just hang up, we'll call your attorney real quick. She said she talked to you, okay? okay. Yeah. I'm gonna call you back, Mom. Okay, right. You got it? Nicole, do you want me to stay? I can walk out. It it doesn't matter. Um, okay. Honestly, Leah, thank you for calling me back. Teresa, are you in there? Can you hear me? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Hey, listen. Um, I'm not going to talk about anything confidential at this juncture, okay? So I'm not going to ask you what's going on or anything like that. The only thing I'm going to do is tell you do not make any statements and don't agree you know, to participate in any kind of interview without an attorney there for you, either myself or Williams, however that sorts out. We can sort that out next week. Mm -hmm. I'll talk to Williams on Monday. And, um, you know, if he's not coming in on it, I'll come talk to you at the jail about where to go from here. But please don't make any statements tonight, okay? Yes, ma'am. All right, so just tell, you know, let everybody know you're not going to um, participate in an interview unless an attorney's with you, and that's not going to happen tonight, okay? Yes, ma'am. All right, so I'll see you early next week unless William is coming in on the homicide, in which case I'm sure he'll, he'll contact you, okay? But I'll be in touch with your mom on Monday. Okay. All right? Yes, ma'am. All right, thank you so much, Leah. I appreciate it. Yeah, no problem. All right, have a good one. All right. Bye-bye. Let me see if he needs his phone back. He still want to talk to your mom. Yes, ma'am. You do? Okay. I think the paperwork is done, so I'm just going to uh, walk out and grab something real quick. I'll be right back. I'll be right back, okay? Right. It'll be like All right. 
You can take a seat in here. We'll take the shackles off. Um, you want water or anything? Hey, how you doing, sir? Hey, how you doing, man? Hey, I'm Detective Saunders. I'm with the Sheriff's Office. Um, you have to excuse my appearance. I don't mean to be dressing down. I actually just walked off a plane like an hour ago. I was in Atlanta uh, before all this. I caught a, caught a baseball game last night. So, um, but yeah, first things first, I'm, I'm Detective Saunders. Detective Abbott is my partner. Um, uh, we work in an investigation. Um, obviously, you know, I want to talk to you about something. Um, but you know, as you know, you're in custody, so I just want to go over your rights first, just to protect you and to protect me uh, from anything else. Okay. Um, and my hopes after that is that I'll be able to answer any questions that you have of me, give you some answers, and hopefully maybe you can answer a couple questions of mine as well. Um, you know, try to help each other out a little bit. Does that sound okay? All right. You want a water or anything before we get started? Any bag of chips, funyuns, or anything? No, my lawyer. Huh? Oh, my lawyer. You want your lawyer? Yeah. Okay. Do you have a, what's your lawyer's name? Kevin Cobbin. Kevin who? Cobbin. Cobbin? How do you spell that? K E B I N. Yeah, I know how to spell Kevin. How do you spell Cobbin? C O B B I N. C O B B I N. Is he local? Yeah, he's right up the street. Okay. Do you have a phone number for him or no? I'm not off the top. Okay. All right, cool. Google has a good phone number. All right. We'll be in touch with him. If you need anything, uh, just knock on the door. Okay. No contact, Kevin. Hmm. No contact, Kevin. I'll call. I'll call him in. The, I'll call him in the morning. Uh, it, it's no rush. We can wait. I imagine that you'll probably want to come and talk to me. So. Yeah. Yeah. Once you around, we can talk. I mean, it's going to be the same conversation, but that's that's fine. I mean, it's your rights. It's not a big deal. But. I mean, we can talk, but I'm going to do that my lawyer wrong. Totally fine. Because you are going to need one, my friend. Come on. <laughs> 